Good evening, uh, welcome to Paranormal Shorts. This is our second outing, Luke. It is, second one for a long time. And um, we have come to Worlington, the small village of Worlington, just over there. What we're actually going to do is follow up on a video which I made back in February where I did a ghostly walk of the unexpected. Which is one I might have missed. <laughs> so, which in a way is quite good because it means that you can tell me all about what's happened yep. here and uh, I, I'm and not also the wiser. a fresh head in exactly, a place yeah. where. Uh, so, Obviously, we've walked, weirdly, as, as I mentioned then, it's, it's strange for us to walk past the church. There's a church just over there in the distance. You can't see it because there's a barn in the way. But um, basically, the activity is not in the church. The activity is in this direction. So we've got a pathway which runs up here, which I've been told is a pathway which goes back to two, three hundred years of age. So it's, it's quite a lot of history. Um, it goes in between two fields, and then as we follow it round, it will take us round to a sort of bend in the river, the River Lark, I believe. Um, and obviously, if anyone did watch that first video, they would obviously know. <laughs> they would obviously know um, that there is activity which has been reported up here: reportings of shadows, of uh, sightings of balls of light, um, of noises, of whispering. Apparently, lots of whispering around people. And then, as we go around to the area where we will stop and have a get a brief chat, and maybe a cup of tea later, uh, is an area where. Um, a man was fishing one day and he, while he was there, it was sort of two, three in the morning. I can't remember this. It was, it was early hours of the morning anyway. And he looked up and he saw what looked like three monks walking across the river towards him and then round the bend. And as he sort of, you know, did a double take, they vanished in front of him. And he was quite shaken up by all accounts. So what we're going to do is we're going to come down here. Obviously, during the day when I came here, I got quite a bit of activity. And I appear to be waffling on quite a lot. But well, again, I don't know any of it. So yeah. this is all new to me. <laughs> Keep going. Yeah, so um, the idea is that we're going to try as, and just to see if it's, if it's any different at night. Okay, so this is one of the areas where activity has been spoken about occurring. So along this stretch here, there has been a sightings of shadows, balls of light, and of like, whispering. Um, firstly, I can say that obviously having had people walk past us, we can still kind of still hear them quite a way off. Um, so it's possible that the sounds of whispering or noises could just be nothing more than just people in the distance. Obviously bearing in mind there is a river about 200 yards that way, so it's possible people could be walking along there. But the thing is, this has happened at night, so is it possible that the noises of the dead are still being heard here? I guess that's what we'll find out tonight. Okay, so I'm going to ask, is there anybody with us here tonight in this environment? come over towards us. If I'm honest, I'm not feeling anything. Well, really. I don't feel anything at all getting nice. No. But then you said to me earlier, last time you came you didn't you had stuff happen but you didn't feel anything. Yeah, it didn't you know it's, it's the thing is that was me. I'll just do that. I'll, I'll just leave it there. Leave it there. Um it's, yeah, I, I didn't feel anything, and then out of nowhere the K2 meter reacted. So, is anything going to go off tonight? <laughs> it's a nice night though. Oh yeah, it's better than being at home. Yeah. Well, at the moment anything's better than being yeah. at home. Yeah. Apologies to anyone I know at home, obviously. Just, yeah. Does anybody here, we've set up some devices on the table, do you think you could come over and try and interact with any of these? I'd quite like you to come and interact with this one, if I'm honest. It would be nice as, it, as it's kind of a, a trial. Try and make yourself as physical as you can. Thank you very much. I'm guessing that's you trying. Try and picture yourself in your that's mind. Really weird. I can feel like a heartbeat through it. Really? Yeah. Imagine how you used to look. You picture that. Now try and bring yourself back to how you used to look. <laughs> 